downtown Detroit where we kick off an NBA Friday night doubleheader on ESPN as the Pistons host the Philadelphia 76ers. That snapped the two game road winning streak. They have been only four and eight on the road this season. Butler's first shot is good. Blake Griffin goes right at Amir Johnson. Bank shot is good. Tyler deal with the Clippers. Six months later, they trade him. That, I mean, that's got to stun you. Even though you know this is part of the profession, as he backs down and lays it up and in. First of Wisconsin. He hasn't found his necessarily his footing yet. I can't wait to see what he might be. Good footing there from Blake Griffin off the offensive rebound on the missed free throw, and he's got eight points. In. And now, 0 for 5 from downtown. McConnell to Butler. Almost coming up with another steal. Butler dives on it. Reddick back to Jimmy Butler. Butler count it and the foul. Well, that's the veteran getting the young man on his hip and making him pay. And we've seen Jimmy Butler do that to a more experienced player. Zaza. The one at Toronto beat Golden State. We mentioned beat Philly earlier. As Griffin banks at home. A lot of contact on that. I'm going to tune in. I'm unaware of what the bet was. Butler on a beautiful pass from Mascala. Those two have developed a nice relationship. Griffin gets away. Inside. Blake Griffin continues an outstanding first half. Buckets to begin the third. And then it's been all sixes. Butler banks it home and they've tied the game. Butler. Up and in, banks it home, and a foul. Tough shot from Jimmy Butler. And a chance for a three-point play. Back up top, Mascala fakes, drives on Drummond. Avoids Griffin, but lost his balance. Butler knocks it down. Not letting him breathe. Offensive foul on Griffin. Who draws the charge? Jimmy Butler. This is what I'm saying. They made the switch to late. They don't make Jimmy guard him the whole game. Have to be separated. It looked like it was just jawing as they were walking up the court. Jimmy Butler gets inside, running shot in and out, but a foul. And Butler upset. He feels there's some extracurricular hitting going on. Watch the end of the play, okay? Foul called. I think it's as much where he hit him on the foul. What a turnaround. Detroit had a six point lead here in this fourth quarter. Griffin goes to the basket, misses. The foul is good. The rookie Brown is on Jimmy Butler. Butler creating some space, jump shot. It's good. 32 for Butler, and the Sixers up by three. He misses the second. Reddick the rebound. They have to foul. Reddick throws it ahead to Butler, and Butler puts the exclamation point on this one. Here's your final score as Jimmy Butler puts on a masterful two way performance. They dominate down the stretch. And Butler does his thing once again in the fourth quarter as Blake Griffin still wanting to get an explanation.